Hit him with the chlamydia for the eardrums. Now, I don't want to be selfish here, but can I make a selfish plug? Yeah, what's that? Because I got an opportunity handed to me about a week ago. I don't know if you guys know who Special K is. Yeah, I remember Special. Yeah, Wait, you was know, he still class- in the city? Classified produced his first few albums. He's still in the and city? He used to be on class albums and shit. He's but still he was in Toronto? Like, no, he's not. He moved. Okay. But me and him were boys, I like right? Because I got him on my last album. Um, I haven't put an official album out since 2015. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. That album was called Perfect Balance. You know, I put out mixtapes and singles and shit, but the game changed. So I stopped trying to make good cohesive albums. Mm-hmm. And that was the best cohesive album I ever made. Mm-hmm. So unless I can top it, I'm just going to keep playing the internet the way that the game goes right now. Yeah. Why try to make an album that's not better, right? Right. But um, either way, so we had a song on there. We did a music video. And me and Spech became really cool because I didn't live in Toronto when I shot that, but I moved to Toronto. Mm-hmm. So me and Spech actually have a whole EP recorded together, uh-huh. but he's not a big fan of his own music anymore. Oh, wow. So now I got to try to convince him and pull teeth that I can finish mixing and mastering this music that we did a few years ago mm-hmm. and put it out. So that's where we're at right now. But we have like good five, six songs in the bank. And then if you add the remixes of shit that we did together in the past with new beats and shit, right. it's like a 10 song project. Right. But anyways, um, shout out to my homie Spech. He got presented this opportunity and I got tagged in a random group chat last week. And they're like, um, Spech is like, yo, I can't make it, mm-hmm. but I highly recommend this dude. So big shout out to my boy Spech K. Mm-hmm. A mad yeah, love man. for you, man. Where's he right um, now? Where, where's he? He's um, it's not Sarnia, but it's like oh. a city out that way. Okay, right, and he's got a kid and shit now. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. like more family kind of yeah, orientation yeah, he's shit a, going you know, on. You can't so he's doing his thing. So he can't case, just come so. up to Toronto yeah. for this one show. Yeah. But he said he's like, I wish I could be there. He's like, but since I can't, he's like, I highly recommend this guy. He's like, he's the next special classified. Like he's the yeah. next one up mm-hmm. of like our type of shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I was like, yo, big props. So either way, the opportunity presented at first, I just thought it was a rap show. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And so I was potentially busy that night, but I thought Spech was going to be there. So I'm mm-hmm. like, yo, I said to my girl, I'm like, yo, let's try to get this night off, switch whatever plans we got, because like Spech, my dude, I ain't seen him in a minute. I'd love to rock a show with him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then when I went on later and further read into the details, I realized he said he can't be there, so he was recommending me. So I'm like, okay, so what's this all about? So then I go and talk to the promoters and stuff. Mm -hmm. So what they've done is they've written a Canadian version of Hamilton. Oh, wow. And they have mad people in this production. Like, one of the guitarists from Great Big C is one of the instrumentalists in this Mm -hmm. production they're doing. Mm -hmm. More or less is producing Mm -hmm. one of the beats that Mm -hmm. I have to do. But basically, I'm one of the historical figures in a song they've wrote. And I have to memorize two songs. Oh, shit. So I'm That's part of this Canadian know. version of Hamilton. Okay. Unbeknownst. Yeah. And I was like, oh, this is but, way cooler. So, when I talked to Omi on the phone the other so day, I'm like, like this is dope. It's like a hip-hop version? or Yeah, just, but, yeah like that. a hip-hop version, but there's like other genres oh, yeah, influenced yeah. and yeah, stuff, right? Cool. But it's like it's like Canadian history, basically, oh, like Hamilton oh, is, mm-hmm. but done through the form of music. So that's it's like sick. the Canadian Hamilton. And right. I can't remember the venue it's at, but Special's like, I wish. That's a classic venue. And I can't remember the name of it. Um... But either way, so that's happening um, June 20th. I should probably look up dates before I plug shit. But either way, once I realized what it was all about, yeah. I'm like, this is dope. I'm getting paid, you know, getting paid a few bills still yeah. for it. I'm like, fuck. Yeah. When I rap my own shit, I'm trying to sell tickets. I'm getting yeah. paid to do this. But you yeah. know what? And my hopes is basically just, you know, the payment's nice. Mm-hmm. That's cool. It's motivational to learn two songs I didn't write. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But just to be a part of something like this. Yeah. It helps. It helps a it's lot. It's so That's cool. Awesome. And the amount of people I'll meet through doing something different like this, yeah. and, you know. And um, I, just, I, just, I, I just thought it was really cool. Yeah. So I wanted to plug that. It is, um, if I can get the group ch- chat up in time before we end this, I can actually tell you more details. Okay, we got it. We got it. So it is, um, it's called Let Me Clear My Throat, a radical new musical about Canada's original forgotten rebel. All right. You could actually use that beat you fucking produced. And it's on um, Friday, <laughs> Friday, June 21st at Hughes Room. Hughes Room, yeah, in Bloor, Bloor and um, Dundas. Okay, so that's where it's yeah. at. First ever showcase of Can- Canada's hot new Celtic hip-hop musical featuring the show's creators. Uh, I didn't make the flyer because I was, uh, you know, I filled in for special last minute kind of thing. Um, but either way, it's going to be cool. It's like basically a Canadian version of Hamilton. And I'm super excited to do it. And That's it's something awesome. different for me. And um, Congratulations. When you do cool shit, you get paid. When you do shit you like, you don't get shit. So to all my hip-hop heads out there, you want to make a career? Start doing shit outside the box. Exactly. Stop just trying to be a good rapper. That won't get you nowhere. 
Unless you're Young Stitch. Shout out to Young Stitch. <laughs> but even he said that he had to switch. He had to do all the shit. Yeah. 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 But, you know, um, either way, something one of you guys said made me throw a shameless plug in there. Shout out to Adam. Shout out to Spech K. All that shit. Uh, June 21st. Make sure you come see us. Hughes Room. I'm not selling tickets, but I can direct you in the direction if you want to come see something special. And if it takes off, hopefully they'll um, include me to be, be a part of it all the way along down yeah, the road. Yeah. That's awesome. You never know. You never know. For those that don't know what Hamilton is, you're sleeping. Cause that's I like thought you meant the city, bro. But then I realized... That's what yeah. my girl said at first. And I had to explain like, that. Hamilton. I'm like, Hamilton? And she's uh, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, Hamilton's big. I've heard, I've heard of it. As far as like yeah. art goes, like that's a big thing, man. But I don't know what it's about. It's all about American history, but okay. all everything is wrapped. Oh, cool. So it's a musical about American history... Like basically, like the Confederation mm. War, like the the Civil War in America, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. And like you know, you got people talking back and forth, but everything's done in rap. Form. Oh, that's kind of like cool. I'm pretty sure Black Dot and uh, Royce like wrote shit for it. Like the whole yeah, soundtrack yeah. is like Black Dot, Royce, Common, like real MCs, and the songs are kind of subject made, but like they're not in the actual musical. Mm-hmm. But I'm pretty sure some of them helped with it. Yeah. But it's like if you haven't if you if you haven't heard Hamilton, like it's a like it's a artistic cultural like revolution that happened a few years ago like it's it's big it's the biggest thing i would say that's happened to yeah. broadway type I've heard, shit I've heard the name. in years i've heard the name i just never really paid attention it's, it's very once you hear the word hamilton no disrespect to people in hamilton but you I love hamilton i personally love hamilton a lot of people shit on hamilton i like hamilton There's shout a lot out of good to people Burns. out there a lot of good people in hamilton shout out to burn shout out to uh jess from um C. Shepard, shout outs to, I got mad people out in Hamilton. Shout outs to Jay Aches, or mm. what's he go by now? Lampman. Shout outs to Slur, or he goes by Matt Heddle now. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck rebrands, even though I rebranded. <laughs> um, yeah, man. Shout out, uh, Oscar Goldman, my boy, you know, um, Adam. He just opened a new graffiti shop out there. Like, you know, like, um, what was the spot on Queen and Spadina where they sold spray paint? Queen and Spadina. Right near the McDonald's. The, yeah, what's they that moved spot up the called? street, actually. It moved up to, but, but the old spot. What was it called? the name of it, man. The bomb shelter? Something like that. Well, he basically yeah. opened his own kind of bomb shelter spot in Hamilton. So I can't remember the name of the store. I'm sorry, Adam, right now. But he's got that popping right now in Hamilton. So shout outs to him. Um, mm-hmm. I got mad people out in Hamilton. Sorry if I missed you. But yeah. Either way, I just wanted to plug that. I thought it was cool. I'm pretty excited about it. And the few people I've expressed my excitement to don't understand the excitement. <laughs> Cause I, like, I oh, it. you're not going up there and rapping. Like, it's like, no, I'm like a part of something. Yeah, else. yeah, yeah. Like, this is cool. You know what I mean? I didn't write the lyrics. I don't give a shit. I yeah. memorized two songs. Yeah. The payment's sweet, but yeah. like, it ain't even about that. It's yeah. like, this is cool. It just adds to your portfolio. It's just being a part of something that everyone yeah. else ain't. You know what I mean? I think you should yeah, not. I think you should make some money moves with that though. Yeah, of like you should be thinking about your career and thinking about yourself. I want to start acting. To be honest with you, you'd be good at it because like, I'm so honestly, fucking weird and random, and I can just you know impersonate almost anything. Yeah, and you don't know how many times I've tricked people into things that I wasn't thinking, but telling them I'm thinking it, and they're like, "What?" And I'm like, "I'm just fucking with you." Like, I can help you with that. You know, you know what I mean? Yeah, that kind of shit. You yeah. know, like. But I wouldn't be one of those corny actors like I only take roles like where I'm gangster and I shoot you like I like I'll be the like you know I'll be the fucking the dude who's defenseless getting raped on the bed like ah my ass and then I'm mentally twisted and I shoot up the high school like I'll do all that shit. I can't wait to clip that one. Hey. I'll take yo. I want to dwell, 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 whatever. I don't give a fuck. Shout out to me. We have an acting studio in here, and I'm sleeping because I haven't gone audition for shit yet. So, wow. you know, you can talk a lot, but actions speak louder than words. So anyways, Canadian Hamilton, let me clear my throat. June 21st, Hughes Room. If you need tickets, I will direct you there, but this ain't pay to play, motherfucker. So it's, called, it's called Let Me Clear My Throat? As That's, far as I can see. Oh, okay. That yeah, has a lot of <laughs> connotations to it. But you remember that beat you just made? <laughs> that beat you just made alone. It's was that hot, though? Yeah, 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 I love that shit. I didn't do much to it, but yeah. yo, the drums that were already there. Yeah. Because it's not one thing. Like, me, I know you as a hip-hop yeah. head. Doesn't it piss you off when a song is so banging and the drums suck? Yeah. Like, let's yeah, be honest here. DJ yeah. Premier 96 Forward, good with the drums and the thump. Yeah. But, like, Mass Appeal, those drums could have been a lot harder, yeah. fam. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, that's yeah. what I did. 900 number by fucking... Um, 
45 King? Those drums ain't really hit like that. Nah, but it was because of the, the, the horn or whatever it was. <laughs> bring it on. I post that, I'm like, fire trash. Someone's like, bring it on sample. I'm like, oh God, this is what the world knows this as. Wow. I'm so whack. <laughs> Mike Stone said it's sick, so that's all that matters. No, I like, I like that Toronto story. Talks, motherfucker. And if anybody <laughs> has something left to say, leave it to our guest. <laughs> no, I'm good. I think I've said it all. <laughs> <laughs> said it off in this mother. Whoa, yeah, there. You, know, you know what's Whoa, funny? Whoa, The art, she just texted me. Remember when she stepped out? Yeah. The artist? Uh, she had to do something with her sister losing her key and all this other oh, stuff. Oh, God. Yeah. So, yeah. She texted me back in the site. I guess it wasn't meant to be. I know she's following you on. She said it wasn't meant to be because she had to do do something with her sister with her keys. So she said oh, it wasn't okay. meant she to, to be. She had to leave. That was she her asked. way of being like, "I'll fuck with your content." I don't know what it was. I'll find out more later. But all right, well, this is no. Toronto Talks, and we're running overtime. <laughs> she's so following you on Peace Instagram, the fuck so out, y'all. I'll tell her to reach out. Whatever. Yeah, but we can talk. And it's stuff. kind of it's kind of a waste of time to come all the way down here. 